The issue of a closed primary surfaced during last year's campaign. The Democratic Party, through its Central Executive Committee, voted to restrict eligible candidates to registered Democrats. They cited a 2004 ruling by presiding Superior Court Judge Alberto Lamorena that upheld the right to a closed primary. But by that time in May, the GEC said it was too late to implement, and ultimately the Democrats withdrew. Now, Party Executive Director Chirac Bourgeoisie is seeking renewed guidance from the GEC. But Board Vice Chair Alice Tyrone clarified that first, the party must include in its bylaws specifically how it will conduct a closed primary. We can't move promulgating rules and regulations if we don't have from any party how it is that they want to conduct their primaries. And even if the party conducts its own primary, GEC legal counsel Vince Camacho says the election commission will still have to certify the results. Once we f we get the information or the updated bylaws, someone within this commission, whether it's the staff or the commissioners themselves, will have to make sure that whatever they, however they do, they document they're going to conduct their election, their election is conducted in that way so that whatever results come out are valid based upon the way they said they're going to conduct their elections. With the next scheduled election still more than a year away, the GEC does have the time now to dot the I's and cross the T's. Otherwise, we're going to be in a situation where it could be, you could have an ad hoc letter from a member of a party that says we want it closed and maybe the, you know, so there has to be some kind of formality within the party that gets transmitted to the Guam Election Commission so that the Guam Election Commission can determine whether that closed primary according to their rules and regulations conform. Nestor Lacanto, KUAM News.